Hey everybody, this is Dave from Team Cinema Pro Med, and what we're going to show you next is how to connect your Cinema Pro Med video goggles up to a PC or Mac or basically a computer. Um, we've had a lot of customers in the past who they capture their own videos, they put movies and things like that on their computer, and they want to be able to show them on the goggles. So it's pretty simple. Um, we're going to use the Cinema Pro Med headset. You're going to need to get an HDMI cable. Um, the Cinema Pro Med does not ship with a separate HDMI cable uh, for video input, so you'll need to provide that for whatever length you need. We're going to use this uh, four footer here today. Uh, we're going to take the HDMI cable, plug it into the HDMI input on the box, okay? And we'll go ahead and power our goggles on so we've got power there. And second step is we're going to take the other end of the cable, find the HDMI port on your computer. And this one is on this side right here, so I'm just going to plug this in like so. Now, <clears throat> the next step is we're going to need to go into our computer and get the right settings. Uh, the Cinema Pro Med Video Goggles requires a 720p connection, meaning that it's going to be 1280 wide by 720 pixels tall, and it has to be at 60 hertz. So the next step I'm going to do is go into the computer and show you how to change your settings to 720p. The process is fairly simple. The first thing we're going to do is go to our desktop on our PC and right click on the desktop, and we're going to scroll down here to graphic properties. Now on this particular machine, um, the graphics has an Intel graphics card. So obviously it pops up the Intel dialog. Um, if you have a different kind of graphics card, let's just say it's maybe an NVIDIA graphics card uh, or another brand, um, still by clicking on graphic properties, it's gonna open up a dialog panel that looks something like this. And we're gonna click on display and we're gonna open up the properties about our display. So uh, here where it says select display, we've got a built-in display. Now I've disconnected the uh, Cinema Pro Med. What we're gonna do is set the settings properly before we connect it. And then once we connect the Cinema Pro Med, it should auto automatically work. So the resolution that we currently have set on this machine is 1600 by 900 and we need it at 1280 by 720. So you're just gonna scroll down your list here and you look for 1280 by 720, which is also 720p. And we want the refresh rate to be 60 hertz. And in many cases, this machine only gives us two choices for the refresh rate. In many cases, you'll have uh, dozens of choices, but you wanna find the one for 60 hertz. Once we get those settings correct, we're gonna click apply. And more than likely, we're gonna get an error here. Absolutely, there it happens. This is not the optimal resolution for this display and that's fine. So we're gonna go ahead and click yes. We wanna save these. We'll get rid of this and we're gonna close out. And now our machine is set for 720p or 1280 by 720 at 60 Hertz. And as soon as we connect the Cinema Pro Med through the HDMI goggles, it'll be working great. All right, so now uh, we have 720p set up on our uh, computer. It's playing in the goggles and we've got a good clear sharp picture here. And it's a matter now we're mirroring inside the goggles everything that's on our screen. So all you'll need to do is to go into your computer, find the movie, TV show, whatever it is you have downloaded, click play on the computer. It's gonna play in the goggles just like it's a secondary screen. And that's it.